Hey guys, my name is Nick. I'm a Microsoft Certified Expert Administrator. I create a lot of content for MSPs, and this video is going to be part of an Intune series here to show you how to enroll Mac OS devices. So one of the very basic prerequisites to enroll a Mac or iOS device is to set up an Apple MDM push certificate. So the push certificate gives you the ability to enroll these devices either with the company portal app or with the DEP program from Apple Business Manager. Now I created another video that shows you how to federate to Apple Business Manager and helps with this process, but this would be one of the prerequisites that you would have to complete as well too. So I'm in here in the Endpoint Manager Admin Center. You get there by going and logging in with Global Admin Credentials to the 365 Admin Center and coming down to Endpoint Management. Here we're going to go into the Devices section and from Devices you're going to want to click Mac OS. And from Mac OS, you'll want to click on Mac OS Enrollment. Now I've already done it, so this is lighting up these other fields, which you'll notice in yours. If you haven't, those are grayed out. So you'll want to click on this, and you'll see my status is active. But you have to agree to the terms and conditions. Download this Intune certificate. This is what you're going to up upload into the Apple uh, account there for the MDM push certificate. And... This gives you the ability to navigate directly to this portal. So this should be your personal, as in your MSP's business account within Apple that you have created here. You'll have your managed Apple ID that's a part of that. And within here, you're probably going to want to create a certificate per customer because in this sense, you're downloading a unique CSR here from Intune in this tenant. So you're going to want to download one for each customer in that sense. So when you do this, you can click on create new certificate. It allows you to upload that Intune CSR here and then download the uh, MDM push certificate file from this store. So it's just like a handoff between both portals to create that trust. And then you enter in your business Apple ID as well here too. And when you upload that, that's when it goes into an active state and tells you how many days you have left until expiration. And you just have to come in here and click on renew if that particular customer is going to continue to have managed Apple devices with you or want to enroll in the Intune program. That's everything I wanted to show for you guys here. Keep an eye out for all things related to Mac and iOS enrollment and management within Intune. If you guys like this content and want to see more, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks and have a great day.